blasted. What happened? Islanders from Skellica. They've taken over crippled Kate's. Taken over? How's that? Clobbered the innkeep, tossed out the girls, then set to drinking. They've been going since yesterday, apparently celebrating some big loot. Yeah, sounds like Skelligers. But you look to be an honest man. Help us. Drive away the hooligans. We've not much, but it'll make a tidy sum if we all pitch in. <sighs> Fine. I'll see what I can do. Really? So there are good men left in the world. Sorry, mate. Gotta fill your horn elsewhere. This establishment's part of Skellige today. <laughs> Seems to me we're still in Novigrad. And in Novigrad, Novigrad rules apply. Rules you happen to be breaking. Just how's that? You're not allowed to drink in peace. Have a bit of fun. Leg it, man, before you taste the wrath of a Skellige. and go. On your best behavior now. Hey. Gents, time to go. No swords, but I firmly uh, trust the axe. Thanks so much. We not have managed on our own. We're not rich. But I hope this is enough. It's plenty. Farewell. I... Uh, I... Noggins. Bring it in, eh? They say the Isles of the War with Lithgow. You do well not to pester fuck. But it's a miracle you came back at all. Not all. You captain of this tub? What's it to you? I'm Skellige bound. Need to get there. Start swimming. Islanders, the black ones, all attackers in those waters. No one sails the route these days. Come on. Clans are ready to deal. Leave you alone if you do. Someone's done it. Gotta have. Not likely. Except maybe that daft bastard Wolverstone from the Atropos. A liar, a thief, and a bugger, that one. He might have parlayed with the sea swine. Hmm. Where can I find him? In a pigsty most times. Others, the Golden Sturgeon. Ask for Flask, everyone knows him. <laughs> you, Wolverston, Captain of the Atropos. So you wanna know if I'm Atropos, Captain of the Wolverston? No fucking clue, mate. I need to get to Skellige. My Atropos and me. We're due to sail for our Skellig. Carrying grain. But that's our shush. Got any coin? Here. That enough? Mm. Hefty sack. Like a bull's. When do we sail? Not sure you're ready. You can barely stand. Know this, stranger. Captain Wolverston never sails sober. The sea goes one way, Wolverston the other. Makes the rock unbearable. So, ready to set sail? Let's go. Ah, first, we must drink to the wind, to good fortune, and to the strength of my Atropos. Anchors away.
Back off or I'll kill you. <laughs> I'm not afraid of dying. Rob every corpse that washes up on shore. Taken from a corpse ain't theft. I'm a man of the isles. I don't reap, I don't sow. The waves bring me my harvest. On the Atropos, were you? Yeah, thought the captain had a deal with you. With us? Meaning who exactly? Might have arranged something with Lugos, but crack? Nay. Clearly should have, though. Outlander ships aren't welcome in these waters. What about you? What do you seek in Skellige, eh? Agreed to meet a sorceress here. Yennefer of Vengerberg. She's supposed to be on Horn Skellig. There's a witch at Kertrolda. Croc's guest. Could be the one you're meeting. That scorn I hear in your voice. You have good ears. Folks say this witch has got Croc wrapped around her finger. Orders everyone about. Word is she's vicious at it. But a hag's a hag. Seen her? Know what the sorceress looks like? Aye. Where's black and white? If not for her tits, you'd think she was a beached orca. Fact is, even those who see her for a wench would gladly push her out to sea, tits and all. What's your name? Stainegrim. Well, Stainegrim, I don't like you. In fact, I feel like slapping you. Go ahead, Drifter. You try. Had enough? Best finish me now, cause you'll be fucked once I catch my breath. It was a good fight. That's enough for now. Know the way to Kertrolda? Expect I'll find it. Head north. Then turn west towards the bay before you come to the bridge. You'll find the Jarl port site today. Your sorceress ought to be there too. Thanks. So long. Faster. not do this, child. I know. But I want to. This madness. Such a young lass. Berna should be the one going. They shared a bed long ago. Silence. It is her decision.
You look beautiful. Thank you. Nice to see you again. The eulogy. King Bran of Clan Twirzech has embarked on his final voyage. At its end, our glorious ancestors await him. Together they will hunt and raid. They will sit round the fire and praise the deeds of ages past. For now, he lives in our hearts. One day, we too shall stand at his side and face the sea together. That will be a good day. You knew Bran? Yes. He was well respected. Unlike his wife. Skellige is its clans. In times of war, tradition holds the clans unite under the leadership of their king. We bid Bran farewell. Time to pick his successor who will lead us against the Black Ones. The gates of Caer Troll stand open to all who hail Bran of Clan Twilsach, dear. Mead and meat will be plentiful. During the wake, those who believe themselves worthy of the crown will step forth. Come to the wake with me. Gladly. Feasts in Skellige, so predictable. Slobbering drunks, brazen boasting, and the inevitable rows that result. Yeah, nothing like the banquets mages attend. Remember the one on Thanid? You were there. How could I forget? I also remember excruciatingly well what happened after the banquet. Reading my mind again? Mm. What's more, I like what I see. Did you learn anything in Velen? Velen. Awful place. Somehow Ciri wound up at the castle of the local ruler, a baron, self-proclaimed. This was after she was injured. Injured? Was it serious? Don't think so. Must have recovered because this baron sent her on to Novigrad. Think she was looking for you at the time. These witches Ciri came across, she was lucky to escape them. Witches? Creatures more like. Can't say exactly what they are, but they're dangerous. Very. Also ran into an old friend of ours in Velen, Kira. What on earth is Kira Metz doing in that wasteland? Hiding from witch hunters. Listen, she told me an elven mage had been there looking for Ciri. Good. You'll need to tell me more when we have some time. Been to Novigrad. Ciri was there, looking for a way to lift some curse. She's not there anymore. You're certain? Heard it from Dandelion, with no embellishments. Do you know any more about this curse? Not much. Ciri ran into some trouble, never finished what she went there to do. I recovered a phylactery. She was looking for a way to enchant it. I'll look at it later. How about you? What have you learned? Something strange happened on Ard Skellig a time ago. A disaster brought about by a burst of magic. Extraordinary, really. Natural anomaly. Never seen anything like it. My intuition tells me Syria was its cause. As much as I respect your intuition, Yen, we need something specific. Evidence. I'd know for certain if I was able to inspect the disaster zone. Unfortunately, Ermion and his druids aren't letting anyone near. Ermion's head of the Skellige Circle? Haven't seen him since... Um... Since Siri was a little girl. I doubt he'll do you any favors. Not even for old time's sake. 
So why won't Ermion let you inspect the area of the anomaly? Call it a difference of opinion. A large, loud difference. Look, it's Krach. White Wolf! Greetings, Krach. I shall see you at the wake, and I'll not accept any excuses. I've an important matter to discuss with you. I shall wear black and white for the feast. I count on you to don something complimentary. Something that doesn't reek of a thousand hunts. Yen, you know I can't stand new doublets. Just too tight till you break them in. And just like Krak, I'll not accept any excuses. We're not here to enjoy ourselves. We've matters to resolve and should dress appropriately. I've rented a room at the inn. Took the liberty of laying out some clothes for you there. You ought to go. Choose something. In the meantime, I've something to attend to. We'll meet at the entrance to the feast hall. to trouble you, but I really have no choice. What is it? Our ship was wrecked against a rocky shore during the last storm. I've lost everything. How am I supposed to help? I haven't even got the coin for the journey home, and with each day's delay I draw closer to bankruptcy. Mm -hmm. Might have guessed you'd come around to coin. So, need a loan? Or is it just alms you're after? I shall pay you back every last copper, I swear it. You need only call on me at my address in Novigrad. Fine, I'll help you. I visit Novigrad often enough. Might stop by, see how business is going. Thank you. You'll find me in the port district. My name is Johan Bonner. See you later then. space and the luxury glamour scent of lilac and gooseberries even with the lid on taste hasn't changed Stuffed unicorn. She fixed it. No idea how she managed to bring so much clothing. Must have hired out a galleon. As usual, black and white. Her megascope? Guess she never goes anywhere without it. As Philippa Hillhart said, megascopes and toothbrushes. 
Deeply personal possessions. Desire de Vries, the poison source, still turns to it for inspiration. You're known as the White Wolf, I know. They tell stories about you every day around here. Looking for an open seat at the table? I'll be fine. Just wanted to talk. Gotta say, I like the place. I should hope so. Found it a ruin when I came here from Undvik. Gulls shitting into the tankards through the gaps in the thatch. I bought the hut, rolled up my sleeves, and made a proper alehouse out of it. Why do you call it the new port? Continuity. Owned the old port on Unvik. Few may former customers come here evenings to reminisce about the old times. Seized this morn, as if the gods themselves were paying their respects to the great Konung Bran. You a tailor? I am. Only one in the Isles, most like. Take it you're good with scissors. Give me a haircut. It ain't something I usually do, but it wouldn't be right to turn down a traveller. So long. Listen, Witcher. Got us some weird diablin. You know, drowners. Real problem. The kind your silver sword could most certainly solve. Let me guess. They're tearing your nets, devouring your fish, and attacking the occasional lone boatman or tavern patron who walks home along the shore. Were that the only harm? Terrors in the bay are meaner than on the continent. They hunt come dusk or dawn. They attack fishermen wielding just oars and warriors alike. Sea tosses them up after. Armor shredded, guts devoured. Strange. Any witnesses? Rurik, my apprentice. He was on a boat the Muir Diablin attacked. There's Tove, too. Her man was killed. She lives nearby, up a bit. Sorry, none other comes to mind. Those who see the beasts, meet him, well, they generally don't come back to dry land alive. I'll take the job. Dealt with drowners many times. It'll soon be over. Got my word on that. You looking for work by any chance? 